Hey guys, today we are talking about PCPs. What are PCPs? Hey guys, okay, so PCPs. PCPs are primary care physicians or primary care providers. So these are Providers are doctors who are designated on a patient's plan as the preferred provider that they would like to see as perhaps their primary healthcare provider for their annual physicals, for example, um, for who, who they would want to go to to kind of help to manage their care and help them to decide on whom they should see for any specialized services that they need to seek. So primary care physician truly is the manager of the patient's care. So when you, the patient, if you are the patient watching this video, then you are actually going to select who you would prefer as the manager of your health care. So it's really important that you spend some time really getting to know your PCP or who you've chosen because that person is assigned to you usually for an entire year's worth of your health care plan. So once you select that person, they're the person that you're going to want to see or need to see before you go to a specialist. Um, office. Um, there's a couple of different things you want to think about when you're dealing, choosing your PCP. Obviously, you want to make sure you just like the person, um, that you enjoy their presence and you res respect uh, their advice and you actually uh, would like for their involvement to be in your care. So really important that you choose someone that's likable. The second thing I'd like you to consider is their wait times. If you have trouble getting an appointment with your PCP and you have to schedule three or six months out just to get an appointment to perhaps see them about a condition that you then need to be referred to another specialized provider for, then that could be a big, a big problem for you, right? So if you have uh, some sort of condition that now you need to go see a physical therapist for, you can't on your own choose to go see that physical therapist. You actually have to be permitted by your PCP to be assigned for that physical therapist. Okay, so one more thing I need you to consider. When a patient has a PCP, there's usually annual updating. So patient, you need to make sure that you're keeping your insurance abreast of any changes. They're gonna want to just confirm that you wanna maintain the same PCP on your plan. If you're a specialty office, you're gonna to wanna to make sure that you, number one, have the patient's most up-to-date PCP on file. You can do that by logging into the payer website or, and or, you're gonna to wanna to make sure that the patient has also updated their PCP with their carrier. If they don't complete that process, it usually holds up your claims for coordination of benefits. It is a step that's required for them to coordinate benefits or to just keep their plans updated on an annual basis. If you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up. And if you're new here, welcome. Don't forget to subscribe so you don't miss out on any videos that will help to strengthen the business side of your healthcare organization. We post videos each and every week. Until next time, my friends.